for Kaylin Cole. Let's go. Somebody clap your hands and give Jesus some praise up in here. Oh, come on, we can do better than that. Somebody give him praise. Do I have any winners in the building this morning? I said, do I have any winners in the building this morning? Come, Kurt, we're getting ready to go higher. If you believe that it's your winning season, somebody say, I will win. That's it, say it again, I will win. Let's go. Yes, sir. The enemy came up against you. Let me came up against your children. The enemy came up against your name. Oh Lord, yeah. and the enemy came up against your character. But I want you to know, you will win. Win. You will win. Oh. Let me came up against your health. Come on. Clap your hands. Come on. And the enemy came up against your finances. Your finances. Oh, Lord, oh, Lord, oh, Lord. The enemy came up against your vision. Oh, Lord. And the enemy came up against your business. Oh, you will. You got to know that you know that you know you will win. Oh, yeah. Yes, you In the air and declare it. it is still my witness season. You ought to shout it like you mean it. It is still my witness season. It's my witness season. So from now on, this is what you've got to declare. Everything attached to me wins. Everybody, let me hear you say. You know that it's your winning season. You ought to let the devil hear your voice today. Let the devil hear your voice today. I still win. My children got to win. My marriage got to win. My business got to win. Everything connected to me. You ought to open your mouth and shout out, I've got to win. Everything attached to you wins. Everything. Look at somebody and tell them.
come say everything attached to you weighs everything attached to you come on tell them everything attached to you weighs put your fist in the air and say it's our winning season it's our winning season I came to tell somebody this morning when the devil gets loud in your ear you got to get loud and declare what God has spoken and declare what God has declared God says that you will win God says that you will win it is still my winning season somebody declare it today somebody When I have a greater one fighting for me, he will never lose. Oh, he will never lose. Can you lift your voice and say and say that he will never, he will never lose. Somebody declare it today, he will never lose. He will never lose. There's never been a time where God has ever lost a battle. Hey, there's never been a time where God has ever lost a battle. You gotta know, you gotta know, he's fighting for you, he's fighting for you. Because you know that this is still your winning season. Yes, Lord. Can I just declare that greater is about to hit your life? Yes. Is there anybody up in here that's expecting God to do greater? Yes. Can you do me a favor and air high five three people and just say greater, 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 greater. Come on, that's it, that's it. Air high five them and tell them greater, greater, greater. I see greater, I can sense greater. I don't know what you've been waiting on, but you ought to open your mouth and say greater. I don't know what you've been praying for, but you ought to open your mouth and say greater. greater. Let's lift this up in the atmosphere. If he had not been for the shame, I never would have been ready for the making yes, of our lives. If he had not been for the beat, I would have never knew how anointed I would be. Oh, yeah. If it had not been for the press, I wouldn't be able to walk into my destiny. And he's preparing me, preparing me, preparing me for my greatness. Say, I feel a shaking. And I feel a beating in the spirit, yeah. I feel a pressing in the spirit. He was only preparing me for my... I don't know who this is for today, but you say, I feel a shaking in the spirit. Sometimes you have to go through the beating in the spirit. You may even have to go through the pressing in the spirit. But I just came to remind you, he was only preparing you for your greater. Hey, everybody clap your hand. If it had nothing for the Come on, say, I never would have been ready for the baby. If it had not been for the beating, yeah. If it had not been for the He 
the reason I had to put you in the fire Wasn't to burn you, but it was to prepare you Wasn't to work against you, but it was to prepare you That's why I had to put you in the pit That's why I had to take you through You had to experience the mountain You had to experience the valley Cause he was only preparing me for life. You know, sometimes you have to get to a place in your life where you have to surrender to God and say, God, I know you know what you're doing. Even when I can't figure out what you're doing, I know you know what you're doing. And so for that reason, I've learned how to turn what I think. I've learned how to turn my situation over into the hands of Jesus. Because I know that you know how to push me into destiny. You know how to push me into greater. I don't know who this is for today. But because you surrender to God, God is pushing you. I, I said God is pushing you. He's pushing you into greater. You want to open up your mouth and shout, push me, Jesus. Push me, Lord. 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 Push me, Lord.